Well, I'm going to have to try and trust this uh, technology because I'm, I'm never quite sure with this camera. This is the most incredible. Um, it's like it's like finding buried treasure because it's how, how the full length is 60, 46 meters. 46 meters. Wow. So this this is um, 2005. The, the the very smart Catherine Coveney came to you with this idea that that uh, here, she probably felt that here's a, here's a part of Greystones that may change and let's let's make a record of it. Yeah. Uh, can you remember how you felt when when you t given what 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 must have been obvious to you was going to be a big big job? Yeah, I was a bit scared. <laughs> <laughs> Because it just, yeah, it's, it's really big, it's so big. Well, you, you told me now, you, you, your kind of approach to it was obviously get a, a, a photographic record of, of what you're going to convert on this yeah. beautiful big mural. Um, and then, setting that out, I mean, does that take like a matter of like six months, a year? How does one even begin to, to plan this? It's a couple of months. Yeah. Right. But no, I started that, um, to do some work with children, some color work, like color mixing. Because I couldn't buy so many colors, so they had to be able to mix colors. Ah. And then. Um, and these are the kids in the school would have been school, involved, yeah. right? Um, right. It was two six classes. Ah. Yeah, 2005. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And I'm sure they were thrilled as well because they would have recognized, you know, the the, the kind of, the the, mm -hmm. the 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 importance of this, and and obviously the joy of of, of making a huge mural is is kind of uh, you know is obvious to even a, a child or to anybody. But uh, were they? Kind of uh, uh, I mean, enthusiastic workers. Was it a long day for them to, to, to take on this big task as well? No, they would come out then for for like I would have six or eight children right. at a time for an hour, an hour and a half, and then they would swap. And I heard from parents afterwards that the children they were so proud ah. that they could. Here and paint. <laughs> and lovely. Okay. So when we're looking at this now, I know that uh, when we talk about the fact that it's been restored, um, but how many children would have been involved then? Uh, ultimately, would have been 20 or 30 children? Or? No, 60 originally. Ah. 60, 64 children. Right, right. Uh, that's quite a great, great number. And of course, that's, uh, they all sort of, uh, you know, by p putting in their own part of it, this sort of adds to the history of what we're, we're looking at. Not only is it a, a visual history of, of Greystones in 2005, but also the fact that these kids are sort of out there now and they would have been part of this painting is lovely that they would have been part of the yeah, creation of yes, it yeah. so as i said the, the, the smart mrs coveney had, had come up with this idea principal coveney when 2005 come around she just recognized that it needed a, a kind of a, a, a restoration uh, was that was that a, a, another big job uh, it yeah, needed a little yeah, bit of cleanup first, first i would uh, do it with the children all right um, but then it it took really long. <laughs> <laughs> the restoration took long. All oh, right. So, is it literally repainting or is it just cleaning? I don't know. I, I, it looks like it's all freshly painted. Was it all repainted? No, it was not. Um, ah. Not all repainted. Like I would wash it down. Right. Clean it, and when paint has peeled off, then you have to, have to repaint. Right. Right. And then it would be sealed again. That's it's a layer. So it's like dirt can be just washed off again. Right. You seem pretty damn good at this. I'm presuming this is the, this is something that you are uh, is a big part of your world because um, uh, to take on a, a project this size suggests that you've got a deep talent in in this area. Was this was this something that you'd ever done before? Is it something that you were kind of involved in before? Yeah, I'm, uh, in the arts, I'm involved in the arts, but nice kind of. But this uh, scale, I don't know if this was something new to you. Yeah, that was new to me. <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't be every day people ask for a 46 uh, meter canvas uh, for their wall. Mm -hmm. But it is, it is a great record of, of, of Greystones. I don't know, for you personally, there's always going to be that um, divide in the town that those who will feel enormously uh, emotionally connected to the original harbour, which is only right, it was, it's very much part of so many people's lives. But, but at the same token, there's those who, who cannot be warm about the, 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 the new harbour. I don't know if you kind of have, have because you were involved with this, great tribute to um, Greystones of, of old. Do, do you have strong feelings in that way? Oh, definitely. Ah, okay. <laughs> the thing is, it's 1980. Right. So I really, yeah, I really love the old harbour. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with the new harbour. To me now, it's, it's a bit like Elvis 56 and Elvis 68. I, I don't mind him with his leathers on. I think there's a, a, a beauty about the harbour now that may and should mm. uh, become, you know, a very integral part of, of people's lives. I think there is something to be said for it, but of course, yeah, okay. It's a unique look and a, u a unique feel to the older. Uh, okay, like uh, it had to develop. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Kind of, there's so many new people moving in. Sure. So 
And it's it, good that they put benches in and a little park or the area where people yeah. can just I think it's going to get better and better. There is a there is a 16 acre park due to be built just further on down from the from the harbour, which will be a big big kind of plus to the town, and it's certainly fit for purpose now. A lot of the uh, kids and a lot of people use the harbour now, and it makes a big difference to their life. So, I think it'll 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 grow on us, and and, and when the weather does its thing to that concrete look, and and hopefully, you know, people will just add their own colour to it as time goes by. It may become as pretty as the 2005 version you have on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm sure you're. I'm sure you're very proud of this. Then it must. It must have been a, quite a quite a happy day when, when this. Uh, you know, you stood back and realised it, it's complete. Oh yes, definitely. <laughs> and was it was it was it a, a overall? Do you, can you can you remember how long it took? Was it a six month job? Was it more or? No, it's about yeah, six months. Wow, six months. wow, that's a big commitment. I'm sure. It, did it ever get tunnel vision? Did you ever think you know, in the middle of it all, what am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to go home and just watch TV for a while. <laughs> no, no, it's uh, a joy. A joy yeah. All right. Well, a beautiful piece of work, and I think, uh, I think people. I, I guess I mean it's up to the school if people can come around and see it. But it is such a great, uh, great, great kind of a, not only a great piece of work, but it obviously represents a great stones um, uh, that we all uh, of a certain age would, would know well and, and remember well. And uh, thankfully, a lot of it's the same. But but certainly, right down there, all that beautiful harbour. It's a, it's just gorgeous to see it captured like that. So you'd never sell it. We couldn't. We couldn't sell this. No. We, I, I'm sure we could get it on eBay. It'd be just, just be kind of. I'll, I'll come up with a chisel and you, you put it on eBay and I've, I've some photographs. We'll do that. <laughs>